Hey guys, Popper793 Ball here, and today I'm back with another video, and I'm not lagging as bad as last time. And today we're gonna be, or er, I'm going to be showing you the version of Assassin Fighters 2.0. It's gonna be in the description as a download. Uh, I got lucky. I lucked out. Or I don't have school today. Yeah, because it's negative 30 degrees. <laughs> um, so, welcome to us, Lark's Assassin Fighters. And over here we have the creators, Lark, Pierre, I, Crump, Crump. Lark is me, because I started the map, and then those two kind of want to join. And over here we have that, tired of red. And then we have this, bleh. And a new thing is, I think I didn't show you this, take a stack of food with you. You take a stack of any of these apples. And it says that on both sides. And then right here, push the button on top before playing the map. It will set all the game rules so that you don't need to, like, slash game rule. What is it? <laughs> and then that's the reset button for the top one, as always. Uh, uh, downstairs. This doesn't act as a bud switch anymore. Uh, but anyway, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to grab glowstone because that's the only block I am going to really need. And we're going to break out here. And I'm going to show you some new stuff. Yeah. All right. So over here we have four dandy players. They all get 16 levels for later things. This doesn't exist right now. <laughs> I need to fix this so hardcore. It's not working properly or anything. So I kind of got rid of it. Uh, yeah, I remember. I just have that sitting there. Um, so I'm just going to break in through the top here. And there we go. Alright, and uh, as you can see, I got rid of the detective traitor because it was making another, at least one more person to sniper because of glitches. Or no, when you chose sniper, it would make you a detective, and then it would turn someone else into sniper, so I had to get rid of him. Sorry! Alright, and we finally get a map selection room. Yeah! Map selection! And that's... I don't know if I just broke something. No, I didn't. <laughs> Never mind. I'm like, I don't know if I just like, literally broke something. Does that suck? Especially. Uh oh. Uh oh. Now I broke something. Now I definitely broke something. Okay. <laughs> Sorry about that. Alright. So, on with the review. We have a new experience shop. And over here we have the two random crystals still there. That only teleports you in if you have at least three levels. These signs over here, uh, you read them for the instructions. That's waiting budget. But right here, stand behind this blue line where someone enters and is inside of that shop. Uh, we actually found a glitch. Uh, so you need to stand on the only empty space that you can stand on. You need to stand right there. And when you're buying all your items, and then when you're done, you stand on the push plate. So, <laughs> you can stand on them, I mean, but, like, if someone has less than three levels over here, they're just going to get, like, teleported over on top of this, and that's not fun. Uh, so over here we have the maps, which is, like, the best part of the update. Okay, so you all know the Rich Nature Mansion. I'm gonna go ahead and show you this one again. I'm gonna get the other map's name. Oh, you guys already saw it. Skyscraper City has been added. I'm gonna show you. Whoa. Yeah, okay. Uh, so, first of all, I'm going to get out in biz. I'm gonna need two stacks of these and some milk. I should have gotten this prepared when I was just starting. So here's the Rich Nature Mansion. We're just going to teleport to it. The spawn randomizer. I'm just going to get a block out. Oh, we already spawned. Whatever, I guess. Alright, so this is one of the spawns. Spawn on the top of this block. I'm just going to go over all the spawns. I don't know if I did in 
the previous dev commentary, or if this map was even in the previous one. So, whatever. I'm not lagging nearly as bad. Um, so we have our little palms there. I'm going to show you a different spawn now. I am pretty sure. Yes. In. Er. Dang it. Stop. Eh. Oh, yeah. Um, so this is the jail. This is one of the spawns. Uh, you spawn in here. Alright. Uh, next spawn. I'm gonna get to the most... I'm gonna get to the funniest spawn, or the most amazing spawn, in both maps last. So this is the second the most. And right here, and you have a nice waterfall right there. And there's the death spawn that I'll be at later. And basically, that's why I have these invisibility potions. And then it's time for the final spawn. Inside the mansion, up the stairs. Uh, it's pretty cool. We made a broken stair effect, or missing stair effect. And here is the final spawn. You spawn in the toilet. Not even joking. Okay. And now it's time to show you what happens when you die on one of these maps. So after you push the press play and you fall off the world, no! Don't worry, the game will keep inventory is on. And basically, you die, you click respawn. You're gonna respawn, you're gonna be in creative, and you're gonna be invisible. And basically, over here, we have the original spawn that takes you back to your original spawn. Uh, we have rejoin the game, and then back here, if we go all the way to the back, this uh, is the hidden stuff. Uh, I'm going to show you what this actually is. So basically, when you stand in the press plate, it powers this command block. It also comes over here, and it powers this dispenser. And uh, invisibility potions aren't as powerful as they say, really, because, well... They're kind of just sitting. So I'm just going to teleport back to spawn again. Oh, wait, no. I'll just teleport over to where I know is a good place to start out. We're going to be in the map selection room again. Uh, yeah, you just saw some of the redstone. That's good for you guys! Okay, let's go in. Oh, yeah, that's right. Milk. Okay, let's break. Yeah. Okay, there we go. Jeez, it's really annoying. All right, slash game mode one. Even though I'm ready in game mode one. Okay, skyscraper city time. Yeah. Spawn red mass spawn. And now we just wait for ourselves. Spawn in the map. Um, it's getting. I'm just gonna break out. And here's the spawning mechanism. Um, I'm actually gonna knock this pig off the edge. It looks like. Ah, oh, you pigs are clogging up the system, aren't you? Well, you need to die then. Alright, no. Um. Ha. So, first spawn is on top of Jesus' head. You can never get up there again, so use that spawn to your advantage. I don't remember any of the other spawns. Oh wait, I remember two more. Maybe I'll remember the last one by the time I finished. Oh wait, I know where the last one is. So we spawn here. Um, we spawn somewhere in here. I'm pretty sure. Oh, here. Oh, I'm pretty sure it's up back corner right here is where you spawn. You spawn like right here. Okay. And then for this final spawn, which is like amazing. And remember I said I was going to save it for last. So I'm just going to fly up. And here we go. 
We're going to the final spawn. As the chunks load, you can see I need stone bricks. There we are. All right. Alright, and then you can place this, and basically you spawn like in one of these corners, I forgot. And it is extremely hard to get back up here, so if you end up falling down, well, it's going to take you a while to get back up. Um, so I didn't spoil too much. Uh, I'm only going to say that's supposed to be a snowman, and... This is a helicopter that you can actually get in. And then this is a window washer thing that you can also get in. <laughs> I'm not going to spoil any more stuff. Um, I'm going to show you what this is. It's a bus plane. C-43 is the first model of a bus plane. They kind of stink. Remember, this is the futuristic stuff. Stuffs. And basically, this is the bus plane... And no one drives this particular one because the first model in is antique. Uh, so now I need to show you guys the death spawn. So let's go down off the edge. Let's get respawned in the death spawn. Let's respawn. Alright, we're going to be in the death spawn. We can go ahead and do that. We have the original spawn button and we're done the game again. I'm just going to leave. And these are where the command blocks are like left out in the open, so you can actually see those command blocks. And over here, we have the same type of thing. And basically, oh, two sets so splash push. Oh yeah, um, I forgot to tell you, it actually fires twice on this one. Uh, it's not a bug. It's because well, it's something I can fix really easily in right now. Why? Moose! Seriously? Seriously, game? Really? Really? You don't want me to fly, even though I was in creative mode for so long. So basically, when you go over here, yes, two more piles. Or no, one, I guess. Ah, stop lagging. I just want to fly. God. Okay, so I'm going to fix this while on camera. So you can, like, see some action, I guess. So basically what I just do for this is I just copy that, break that, and since the thing is right above that, I just go down once and I place the command block and I copy or bleh, paste it and then I just throw everything else away except for this because I need to drink this and now I'm not invisible uh so I I really think that you guys are going to and dang it why why birdie no anyway um, <laughs> I really think that you guys are going to enjoy this. Yeah, so it's style size 1.7. I need to fix that. Let's call it 2.0. Let's rename it. And I'm going to actually show you something. So when you have that, then you want to go into MBT Edit. Go to MBT Edit. You want to click Run. Wait for it to run. Which usually doesn't take too long. File, open, ah. Basically, I'll navigate to this folder. I'm gonna go back to saves. I'm going to rename. Dun 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 dun. And I'm actually gonna show you how to lose. Orbit edit for one thing. Click that. Click a low command zero. X and. Click yes and X and single player 
And now it's on the adventure mode, and that's all. That's a Kubano. Yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. My name is Papa Sir and I threw ball. And peace out, peeps. Yeah. No, okay. Anyways, guys, comment, rate, and subscribe, and goodbye.